Last week, scientists from the University of Toronto discovered the earliest evidence of winemaking with the unearthing of six wine jars dating back to 5,000 B.C. Here to discuss is University of Toronto researcher Jen Clompton. Hello, uh, Professor Clompton? I'm Professor Jen Clompton. Professor, congratulations on your discovery. Thank you. I'm very sleepy right now, it's okay. Professor, are you all right? I'm good. We found some wine, we brought it to the lab, and then we find out it's the oldest wine in the world. We started celebrating, and then the wine went missing, and then everybody's mad at me. Oh, Professor Clompton. Uh... Prove it. Just try to prove that I drank the wine. Well, your lips are purple. Oh, what a great mouse detective. Huh? I'm not a big drinker, you know? You know how it is, you're out dancing, a little bit of fun, and then next thing you know, you drink six pots of caveman wine and throw a punch at a lab skeleton. And so I did. So what? What would you do? Well, how strong is 7,000-year-old wine? Everybody tried to tell me. But I didn't listen. They tried to tell me. Oh, Professor Clompton, you know, sleep on your stomach. You know, Professor Clompton, your right boob is hanging out. Professor Clompton. <laughs> You wet yourself. Oh, well, blah, blah. Okay, Professor, you're, you're drunk. Give me a kiss. Come on. Kiss, I'm gonna kiss the camera on this end, and you kiss the one on your end. Come on, you doing it? Yeah, I'm, I'm kissing it. Okay. Uh, drunk Professor Jen tell. Clompton, everyone. <laughs> Laughter is part of a well-balanced diet. Don't forget to subscribe to 22 Minutes Below so we can do this again soon.